Look at this dude. What's poppin' everybody? Welcome back to another Minty Woo. Hey man, if you haven't already, then so make sure you are subscribed to the channel, smash the like button, click that bell while you're at it so you can be a part of the post noted gang family, best family on YouTube, and that is no cap hands. <laughs> hey man, we are here for another South Park compilation. This is uh season four, episode one. Cartman makes a tooth fairy business. This don't be funny. For the ones that don't know, this is my second reaction channel. My main reaction channel is the first link in the description. Go show mad love and support to all my other YouTube channels. I would greatly appreciate it. But hey man, we're gonna do less talk and more reacting. Let's dive right into this video. Let's go. Uh, seriously, something wonderful has happened. Mom, look, the tooth fairy. I put a tooth under my pillow and she gave me two dollars. She's only given me a lousy quarter before. Perhaps now you should take that money and open it. And now you rich, you got two dollars. The savings account that has compounded daily interest. <laughs> You can compound daily my ass with interest, Mom. I'm going to the toy store and buy me a skateboard. Oh, my God, you guys, guys, just wait. <laughs> he pretty much just told his mama, nope, Dad, I ain't saving this money. I'm spending this bit. <laughs> Can you hear this, you guys? Look at what the tooth fairy left me last night. Two dollars. No way. Dude, every time I lost a tooth, I only got a quarter. I only got a jar of gefilte fish. Look, I don't a know what? why the tooth fairy's being so cool to me. Maybe she's hot for me, I don't know. But if we all chip in with teeth, then I can hide them under my pillow, and we can get enough money to buy a Sega Dreamcast. A Sega Dreamcast. I used to have one of those. I already lost all my baby teeth. Me too. Damn. Okay, the string is tied to Kenny's tooth. I'll tell you why. Poor I'm Kenny. You, Kenny. Because your family is poor and therefore has bad oral hygiene. So your teeth are going to fall out someday anyway. If you think about it, you should actually be thanking us. Carmen's stupid, bro. You guys, you reckon, Kenny? Oh, oh, hey, I got a loose tooth right here. But you can't have it. Well, I'm gonna stick it under my pillow and get money from the tooth fairy. Dude, maybe we don't have to rip the tooth out of Kenny's mouth. Yeah, we just have to get Butter's tooth. Let's go. Go, Timmy, go. Yeah. Oh, he naked. <laughs> <laughs> the way he laughed at him, bro. Uh, careful, you asshole. What the? Careful, you asshole! I am the tooth fairy, my child. Come on, fat ass. Well, buzzer. Good night. Mission accomplished. What do you have there, Eric? Another tooth fell out today. I'm leaving it for the tooth fairy. Guys, oh my God, you guys, you're not gonna believe it. Four dollars. Oh. Four dollars. Well, come on. Do you guys know what this means? Yeah, we just gotta keep finding teeth and putting them under your pillow. Dentist office. Oh, hello, Dr. Roberts. It's my son. He's lost a lot of his baby teeth, about 112. Yep. His mama's stupid. The son wouldn't happen to be an alligator, would he? No? An yeah. alligator. Oh. Yeah. He didn't get no money? Well, it's just that, well... <laughs> She's broke now, my boy. You pulled out 112 teeth, my boy. Tooth fairy ain't real. Mama broke now. Took there all her money. There is no tooth fairy, Eric. I've been putting all that money under your pillow, that and part. because you've had so many teeth fall out, I've actually run out of money and can't you. go to the grocery store for at least a month. How can I trust you? How can I trust anyone ever again, mother? Oh, he's heartbroken. Oh, he mad. There's money. There is no money. No more there money. There is no money. Oh, God, I don't even know how to tell you. Tell us what? You guys, there's, there's no tooth fairy, you guys. There, I said it. But now my mom's given us so much money that she's bankrupt and we're poor like Kenny. Man, I can't believe all our parents lied. Just give the money back, my boy. It's about the tooth fairy. You guys, you guys, I figured it out. So all we have to do is go to a really rich kid's house, put our tooth under his pillow, wait for his parents to leave him a whole buttload of money, and then sneak back in and take it. Oh, oh dude, that is tits. I mean, that is big fat Oprah tits right there. <laughs> big fat Oprah tits, I'm wow, dead. the size of these houses. There's obviously kids living there. This is the smartest business venture ever. These kids some criminals, bro. What the? <gasps> hey, you ripped off our idea. What the hell are you talking about? We've been doing this for over two years. How dare you? <laughs> Look, this is our turf. You better scram before the boss breaks your legs. All right. The doctor. boss? Who the boss? Come on, we're going to see the boss. Who's the boss? My associates here tell me you were working Cherry Creek tonight. Kids have been doing the tooth fairy rack in this town for years. I do it just like my big brother before me. My oldest brother before that. Damn it! And we thought we were so original! Let me ask you something. You were gonna sneak a tooth under this rich kid's pillow? Then what? How are the kid's parents gonna know there was a tooth under their child's pillow? Look, any schmuck can sneak through a window wearing a pretty dress. The tooth racket is much more involved. We keep careful track of what houses we've hit so that we don't hit the same one twice unless the Hey, these some badass kids, bro! Inside the house, we not only have to sneak a tooth under the pillow, but leave a note for mom and dad to see. 
This is how we let the parents know to leave money under the pillow. Once the notes have been placed in the last house, we start all over, going back to the first house. But this time, all we have to do is collect money. And the kids never know what And y'all never get caught? Pet them. The hardest part is getting teeth. We try various places. Cemeteries. Hockey games. <laughs> Anywhere we can find them. Damn, they're beating up the kids. Oh. The teeth we do manage to acquire are then sorted according to size wow. and quality. Wow. This is a for real criminal business going on right here, bro. This is a sweatshop, bro. Cover enough teeth. Look at all them Cover teeth. Enough. Amazing. Man, that is tits. How that much do we get if we work for you? I'll cut you in at 2%. We're in. 2%? That's it? <laughs> Hello there. Does he have a pimp jacket on? Children. Hey, Jack. We all want double desserts today. Oh, well, uh, I'm afraid that the school charge is extra for that. Yeah, well, that ain't nothing but a thing. Oh, my God. That's got to be at least $15 here. That's right. Keep the change, my man. Well, look Keep at you. Keep the change, my man. With your money and your fancy clothes and your cell phones. It's almost like you were... Oh, my God. Children, what have I told you about drugs? That there's a time and a place for everything, and it's called college. That's right. And the only thing worse than doing drugs is dealing drugs. We're not dealing drugs. You're not? No. Oh, uh, well, children, whatever you're doing, just remember this. Having money may seem fun, but... Oh, oh never mind. Thank you. Having money is fun. What do we need, Lukey? We know how the trade works. Why don't we do it ourselves and keep all the profit? Oh, damn. We can't do that, dude. Lugie will kick our asses. Uh, what the hell is that little Polak gonna do? Huh? Come on, you guys. I say we create our own mob crime family. So, you brought me 400 pounds of tea from China? That's right, yeah. It's all top grade stuff, too. These Chinese kids are selling the tea for peanuts, see? These are cat teeth, you son of a bitch. You're trying to sell me 400 pounds of cat teeth? <laughs> Get out of my sight. <laughs> Lousy little scum. What? This is your last chance, kid. Oh, they got Kenny hostage right now. Damn. You crap. Kenny's not afraid of you. I'm dead. All right, dude. <laughs> okay. Billy is in desperate need of a bone marrow transplant. The water definitely wasn't deep enough. Or he will most certainly die. Billy, how much more money do you need for the transplant? $600. Wow, that's a lot of money. Billy, I also understand that you lost a tooth today. Yeah. Billy, we want you to put that tooth under your pillow tonight because we have a feeling that the tooth fairy is going to leave you $600 for it. Really? Really? Yeah. You're about to rob this family with that $600. Yes, really, $600. $600, you guys. Come on, get your stuff together. This is going to be tits. Hurry up, you they guys. got a swimming pool in their room. Sometimes oh. I think I can see Poor Kenny. Down. My own existence fading. Poor I'm Kenny. Now, mommy. I put my tooth under the pillow. I can't wait to feel healthy and strong again. Yeah, well, you're going to have to wait a little bit longer, Billy, because that 600 bucks is me. Carmen an asshole, bro. Nothing's real. Reality is... Oh, God! It's happening! Kyle? What just well, happened? Well, well, well. What do we have here? Ah, oh, shit. I got it! The tooth fairy! Let's move out! Give it up, kids. You're surrounded by dentists. It was a trap. That's right. And now it's a They've been under investigation. It was a setup. Damn. It's all exposed. You're through. This, this is reality. Is reality. I am and no What the hell? What's going on? <laughs> What's happening? It was a setup all along. How could I be so stupid? Oh well, maybe it's good my empire's fallen. Really? Yeah, I kind of wanted to play on the flag football team this year, anyways. So you're not gonna hurt us or nothing? Nah, in a way, I'm just glad the whole thing's over with. <laughs> Poor Kenny. <laughs> Damn, how they do Kenny like that, bro? Go save his little butt, bro. <laughs> I'm dead, bro. <laughs> Hey, man, if y'all made it to the end, I do greatly, greatly appreciate it, man. Smash the like button, leave a comment down below. Click that bell while you're at it. Until next time, I'm going to see y'all next time. I'm out.